What's going on guys? I'm Jake, the Offensive Gamer, and this is Tales from the Borderlands. Uh, before we get into any of this, I probably should say a few things. Uh, for one, um, I'm not actually much of a Borderlands guy. I've played some of the, uh, some of the second game, and I played some of the pre-sequel that came out earlier this year. And, uh, I've enjoyed them, but I never was particularly interested in the world. Um, that having been said, Telltale is known for being able to tell a pretty damn good story. So, I figure if there's any sort of, uh, developer that could get me interested into a world, I bet it probably would be Telltale. Um, so, that's a thing. Uh, also, uh, I, I probably should also say that I, I wasn't expecting this game until pretty much, like, I'd say three or so days ago. Uh, it just kind of sprung up on me. Evidently, Game of Thrones is supposed to come out in December. Uh, so, you can probably expect that as well. I'm going to be doing the full season on this. And, uh, yeah, that's about it. I really haven't done very much uh, reading or keeping track of all that's going on with this series. So, I'm, I'm, com I'm coming into it pretty fresh, just so you know. Anyway, let's get started. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title of Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. He ran the corporation Hyperia, and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less. Ah, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Fiona! Come on, we can work this out! Fiona? <laughs> what, is there some sort of radiation leak I don't know about? <laughs> Well then. Where exactly are we going? I ask the questions. Okay, then uh, do you mind asking yourself where you're taking me? Ow. Oh, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas project. <laughs> is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smartass. <laughs> I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're. Getting dragged through the desert and, uh. From the beginning. Right.
Thumbnail. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. And Handsome Jack, he was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel good I to wanted to be rabbit, just you know? like him. Take it. It's yours, right? <laughs> I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. Animals. When Handsome Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the best. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Henderson's making. I do his payroll. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Being an exec in Hyperion comes with expectations. It's not about money, Vaughn. It's about the respect it gets you. Yeah, you know who talks like that? Poor people that no one likes. Respect, it's nice, you know, but it's not nicer than a summer home on Eden 7. Get your priorities straight. We're meeting with a vet afterward to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep, sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. You're damn right I deserve it. I earned this. Well, Yvette and I did contribute. Right. Sure, you... you help some. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. Mr. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Is that because Joe from Family Guy? Better. Look, don't concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am, you're not too happy about it. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop, but it's for the better. At least for me. You're going to be reporting to me now, Reese. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming to you. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North, why the handsome guy always gets the girl, and why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a cock. <laughs> it's destiny race. And men, real men, men like me, make their own. And you could hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul, your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fate. Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps dramatically make my point. Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny. And put you on your own path. And that, my friend, 
is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digistructing in my office yet? Vasquez, it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this vault key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million, yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Well then, th uh, that's a dead guy. Three years sucking up to the guy. Out the window. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, oh, but... nice. Oof. Why do the biggest scumbags always have the best view? Do you want the money or not? Because I... Should be me. Only less. It's not. No, it Vasquez won't be a big deal for me to get. I think starting off this character, I'm gonna be a bit of a dickhead. I kind of like that idea. Yes. I'll explain later. Yeah, that's what we had before. Yeah, just slicking my hair back. That's all. It's a working day, August, and I just got this promotion. Pandora's potential for profit is rivaled only by its potential to kill you within minutes of setting foot on its surface. Uh, look, 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 are you Eight. going? Why are you turning this into Status a not face? well. Such a nice suit. Gotta say, that is a fair assessment. Can I in there? Yeah, there we go. Trying to screw me on this. Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down it. If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say out of your mouth. Damn it. Oh, right. Now, uh, what were we talking about? Before we were so rudely interrupted. You were lecturing me. It was taking a while. All right, your uh, promotion. Henderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you, I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm gonna make you assistant vice janitor. What? Oh, oh shit. No, no, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. Fine. I've had to do worse in my career. That's the spirit, Reese. Nothing teaches you humility faster than scrubbing toilets. You're dismissed, Reese. I'm already enjoying playing this character. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. Huh. What the hell was that? He can't do this to us! He just did. No. No, no, this can't be happening. I'm finished, Will. I'm finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water, and everyone can smell it! No, 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 they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. Senior Vice Janitor 
Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. <laughs> Because that is your job now, to clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something? I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. <sighs> he threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to Trash Man. Holy crap. So, does that mean you're not buying? Ha. Huh. That's hilarious. Well, just try and lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type we to... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We could throw him out an airlock. Worked on Henderson. Yeah. Except I'm not a murderer. Oh, right. There's no way Hyperion would let Vasquez do that to him unless there was a good reason. The vault key. That's it. What vault key? Vasquez has a deal set up on Pandora to buy one. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is his vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Askez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Cool. Well, looks like you boys got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed, Whoa, whoa, right? whoa, hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two. You know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends! Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter? Yeah, totally. Used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now, and when you get back. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. <sighs> Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? I mean, you can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe a convertible or something? Sure, yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected, right? Look, it just... If you're gonna steal something, I uh, figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. That wasn't very nice. That is so copyrighted.
holy freaking crap, what was that? What? What do we even, oh, what do we even hit? Why? Oh, I hope that wasn't like why a really ugly person. What'd you cross right there? Oh, <laughs> crap. I think we, I think we killed it. Are we murderers now? We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great, we murder. Vaughn, I'm more worried about the dent in the car, okay? First of all, it's Vasquez's company lease. And second, I'm sorry that I break for birds yeah, or whatever, yeah, but... but you wouldn't break for monster birds. That thing was a, a nightmare creature. Ugh, just drive.